I am never going back to Photoshop after using my Capture One to color grade my pictures. Why did I say this? Photoshop has control. So I want to, I want to just suppose between Photoshop and Capture One, which one is more better? So let's see which one will win. So Photoshop has control, number one, in the sense that it has control over the opacity of your color grading. Like if you're color grading now, you can easily reduce and increase your opacity that has much control, vivid control on your color grading or on your subject. Why Capture One doesn't have that full control of the grading, which is the opacity. I've not seen I've not seen that yet on Capture One. So number two, Photoshop does not have this full control of you trying to color grade and it's color grade your all overall image. That is, if a subject is wearing red, and you know we have the reds in the skin, we have yellow in the skin. When you're color grading, it tends to color grade the overall image on your subject. While Capture One has this full control of we trying to segment the dress color and the skin color in the sense that that gives easy flow of work while we color grade. And I love it so much that I don't have to stress myself on trying to, you know, color grade the um, skin and it's affecting the dress or it's affecting the skin tone. I'm trying to grade the dress, it's affecting the skin tone. So Capture One gives us that cool access and cool function to, you know, elevate our grading and does not affect one or any, any other um, part of the body or any other part of the clothes you can easily mask out but photoshop you have to mask you have to mask first before you can color grade but capture one you just select the skin and you're good to go so tell me in the comment section which one do you use to color grade and why do you use it i will see my next video peace out do want to subscribe to this youtube channel i'll see you next time bye